YouTube, it's me guys, Zavarari here. How are you guys doing today? Today, Borderlands 2 guys, I know, Borderlands 2, first time in my whole career of being, I don't even say career, my, the whole history of me being on YouTube, I've never done Borderlands 2. So here we go guys, Sanctuary, how to get behind Marcus, really important guys, come over here, over by the bar, and uh, then jump on this little light post here, and uh, it takes me a little bit to jump on here. It's kind of hard at first, but once you get the hang of it, it's very easy, you can just do it like that. And uh, yeah, so after that guys, uh, man, I, I got to that ledge, that would have been perfect, but I tried to get back up there, and I failed. But then you need to jump over here, guys, over to the light post, or the other light post thing, uh, the lamp, I should say, on the wall. And uh, then come up here, and then run, and it's really important you run and jump. And uh, once you get over here, guys, make sure you stick to this wall. If you go any more to the left, you will fall and die. So I'm just fast forwarding here, guys. I'm looking at uh, what's back here, like that uh, little gun uh, store, which is actually what Marcus offers to you um, when you visit the armory and the you know the gun range and whatnot. Uh, just it's like hidden. So how cool is that, guys? So what you need to look for behind here, guys, is a vault, and there is the vault. So that's the opposite, or sorry, the background of what you see when you go to visit Marcus. So you're on the opposite side of that. How do you get past that? Mm, very good point, very good question. And here, we're going to answer it right now, guys. So, look, come over here, the right side of the vault, you're right, and uh, just walk right through the wall. You can do it very easily, and boom, you're right there with Marcus. You could you could talk to him, you could shop with him, and all your friends can be here, too. And, you know, uh, it's just really cool, especially if you want to make, like, a machinima on uh, Borderlands 2. I don't know who would, just because of all the, uh, you know, all, you're a HUD hat. Your HUD, your HUD has so much stuff, like your health, your players in the party, the map, the ammo, you know, your level and all that stuff, but, you know, who knows? It, it might be something cool to start off a video or something. That's up to you guys, so, yeah. Now, let's move on, guys. So, now in order to get over to the gun range, inside the gun range with the dummy that's that's there, uh, you just have to come back right through that wall that you came through, and be careful, don't walk too far out, otherwise you will fall to your death, and it'll cost a lot of money. And uh, you'll be all sad face. So make sure you stay along this wall so you're right um, once you get, you know, over here inside the building. And uh, yeah, so now we move on, guys. And, uh, you know, I'm just turning my brightness because it got a little bit dark. So yeah, just stick to the right over here, guys. And you're going to see my buddy uh, over here, TBTI Gods. Uh, he unfortunately falls to his death because he uh, went a little bit too far. And you guys will see what a little bit too far means. So. Here we go, and he walks a little bit too far, and he falls to his death. How about that, guys? So if you turn the corner, you'll see this little ledge. You need to get on that ledge. <laughs> Anywhere, any, you know, a little bit more uh, forward past the ledge, you're going to die. So, guys, look at that. We're in the shooting range now, and here's a little dummy that, you know, you could shoot at, and he doesn't lose health or he doesn't die because uh, he just pinned up on that dartboard in the back, and uh, you can just waste all your ammo. And it's just really cool because, uh, you know, you have your friends on the other side of the uh, shooting gallery start uh, shooting at you or something. I don't know, guys. Whatever you guys want to do for a video. It's just a really um, the fun and cool uh, glitch to show some maybe some new people on Borderlands 2. Maybe if your brother, cousin, sister, sibling, step-siblings, step-cousins, whatnot. Uh, you know, if they come over and you want to show them something cool, this, this could be it, guys. You can just be like, hey, look at that. Now turn your head again. Boom. There I am. I'm inside of it, guys. You try to do that. And, uh, yeah. But there is one bad piece of news, guys. If you guys do do this uh, little... I don't want to say glitch, Easter egg kind of, not even Easter egg, it's a glitch bug thing. The only way to get out is to die. You cannot go back, you cannot jump back through the walls, nothing. So, even if you do come over here on, on the other side of that wall, you will still have to die in order to, you know, uh, go back to Sanctuary and then go fast travel to wherever you want. So, here, I die, guys. Yep, I know. <laughs> anyway, guys, thank you guys so much for watching. That's how you get behind Marcus in Sanctuary on Borderlands 2. I'm Zevadar, guys. I really hope you guys like this video. I really appreciate you guys watching it. Click the top box if you take you to the previous video. It's a Peacekeeper SMG Easter egg on the new map pack, uh, Revolution more specifically, the map Hydro. And uh, it's really cool. Check that out, guys, when you guys get a chance. Mystery video down below, uh, the bottom box, I should say. Mystery video is a mystery video. Can't reveal what that is. Huge shout out to Private Miller, my buddy Private Miller, one, two, three, and uh, TBTI Gods, who I mentioned before, and also uh, my other buddy, uh, Noom, Noom Beans, Noom, Noom Beans, I can never pronounce his name, God, anyway, <laughs> anyway guys, I'm Zephyr, I really hope you guys like this video, I know I did, and I love making it too, more Minecraft, more Black Ops, all that good stuff is on its way, I'll see you guys later, peace out, have a great day, and uh, yeah, peace out.